Hey guys, welcome to another Tito tutorial. For the newbies, this is basically a segment where we explain things in a way that even a Tito like me can understand it. And today, we're talking about copper masks. Now, the idea of using copper to disinfect or for antibacterial is nothing new. The ancient Egyptians have been using it for centuries or centuries ago. So how does it help with viruses like Corona? If the virus lands on something like steel, it will stay there for five days. For something like wood, that's about four days. But it's only a matter of hours when it's copper. This makes a big difference when you think about the amount of masks that we throw out every day that do have the virus on it. So yes, there are benefits to this. Aesthetically, well, color tone alone should already tell you it's a little bit more matched than the white one, but it's more contoured to my face. Plus, I like the fact that it has this little breather under the chin which stops your glasses from getting fogged up. So in the box, you're going to get one piece antimicrobial copper mask film with 10 pieces of the non-woven fabric filters. You can wash these uh, usually about three times. If you average out the cost because you have to replace a copper mask every 30 days, it works out to about 11 pesos per day. That's it for this tea tutorial. Stay safe, see you soon.